Thank you for watching Nakamatome channel. I'm Shogo Nakamura from Nakamatome. Today, I would like to explain to you a new function we'll be installing on our machines. Starting today, the oscillation cutting function can be installed on these machines. First of all, I would like to explain what is oscillation cutting. Cutting chips are a big problem for using CNC machines. Long chips get wrapped around the tool and work pieces, causing defects. This is also a problem for automation. To deal with this, I think it's common to use chip breakers and high pressure current. They are effective solutions. However, we need extra money to use them. Sometimes we face cutting chips cannot be broken by chip breakers. High pressure current equipment takes up a lot of space in a factory and it consumes large amount of electricity. Oscillation cutting will be another option to solve cutting chip problem. Oscillation cutting is a function that breaks up chips by vibrating the tool. This is how it works. The oscillation to create this wave-like machining pass. Look at the green line and blue dot line. These lines are tool passes. There's an area where these two lines overlap. The tool goes through an area that have been cut once before. This makes air cutting time, breaking up chips into small pieces. How is this program? It's also very easy to use. A program containing the G code can be executed by inserting just two lines. Insert the G code G8.5 V2 means oscillation function turn on. If you want to cancel it, just set to V0. Then you can select Z0 or X0. It means you can choose oscillation on X axis or Z axis. Argument I is oscillation frequency ratio. It means how many times it will oscillate per rotation of spindle. I0.5 means one oscillation per two spindle rotation. Argument K is amplitude ratio. This is the value used to determine the amount of return. For example, K1.2 and feed rate 0.1 mm per revolution means that the tool will return 0.12 mm. These codes are inserted before the command for the machining operation that requires oscillation cutting. Please don't forget to enter the cancel command of G8.5 P0 after the oscillation cutting is finished. Again, we can install this function on these machines. WT100, WT150 Mark II, W100 Mark II, W150, NTY3100, 150, and MX100. These machines are suitable for mass production with automation. We often install bar feeder, gantry loader, and robot system with them. So I convince oscillation cutting is really attractive application for them. Okay, let's go to the factory to see machining with this function. Okay, I'm in front of the machine MX100. MX100 has a two spindle and one lower turret. Today, I will be machining 304 stainless steel with oscillation function. Let's start machining. Okay, this is OD roughing in lower turret. At first, turning without oscillation. Without oscillation, you can see long cutting chips. This is not good for automation and chip conveyor. Then we will start to turn on oscillation. You can clearly see cutting chips are divided to short pieces. You can turn on and turn off even in such a single tool pass by just inserting G code. This is cutting chip without oscillation. Quite wrong. This is cutting chip with oscillation. The oscillation cutting divided the cutting chip. It's clear the oscillation cutting is effective dividing cutting chips. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please click like button. If you have not registered yet, please do so. Thank you.